when a history buff and a World War II vet accidentally bump into each other and get their weapons crossed. Well, thanks to a nerf Fortnite of all places. God, imagine hearing that in any other context. Thanks to nerf Fortnite. And the nerf Fortnite dual pack. We finally have an answer with the Flint Knock Pistol and the Fortnite Light Pistol. Bundled together, these two wildly different single shot blasters are bundled, and honestly, they're single shot blasters. But man, the shells on these things, man. An underrated feature of Nerf Fortnite is the ability to take a real steel weapon, gussy it up and kind of goofify some of the proportions a little bit, and then still be able to sell it into the market a-okay. Some of my favorite shell designs have come from the Nerf Fortnite line because Fortnite is just cartoonish funhouse mirror variants of real life weaponry and whoever's still using flintlocks nowadays. Oh my goodness. This bad boy right here, the LP, the pistol, resembles the Colt 1911. And everything from the comfortable handle to the realistic slide action, this honestly might be one of my first modding targets. I don't know what's exactly uh, in here. But just off of that stuff alone, I feel this would make an excellent jump-off point if I wanted to get into modding like that. Provided uh, the interior does not disappoint me. Now, the flint knock pistol is not actually a flint lock, because where are you going to find gunpowder for this thing? Instead, it's a very high hammer action, which I guess kind of gives you the vibe of a flint lock, but I, I don't know, man. I already have a hard enough time with a hammer shot or the uh, 6SH Fortnite blaster trying to get this guy. I can't imagine yeah, getting this guy down and ready to shoot, but honestly, as far as unique blaster designs go, and the fact that it kind of looks like that Roblox snake sniper they tried to do a couple... Was it a couple of years or was it a year? I don't know. I'm behind on my Nerf for Roblox. Maybe I should get into it. Who knows? As I said, this is a very quick and very easy way to incorporate two very cool looking weapons into the hobby. But for $20 on Amazon, how do they shoot? Well, I guess we're going to find out. Anybody care for an egg roll? Ooh, we got we got color coded darts. We got we got black and red for the flint knock, and we have the blue and I can't I want to call it cyan teal, whatever that shade of blue is for the other one. Let's get both of these guys. Loaded and primed, and uh, let's see how to do. Don't really need a full-length uh, transition for this one, do I? <laughs> this is more of a uh, a quick look at these two. Not too many jokes, not too many gags here, but I did want to get something slightly more recent up than the content I recorded a couple months ago. That's still depressingly stuck in editing hell. Which is just a pencil and a question mark held by the devil, of course, editing hell. I will say the flint knock fits very nicely into the shell. It's not it's not poking out like this guy is. I wish this slid in there like that. Cause uh, you wouldn't even be able to tell. Looking side by side. But minor gripe. And of course, you know, removing the dart post would kinda help, but Let's uh, get these guys shot off somewhere where I won't lose these darts. 
on a bit of a time crunch, so we're just going to let cooler heads prevail and blast this into the distance. Okay? Stick with me. Woo! That kind of a punch to it, I'm not going to lie. Jesus! Maybe I underestimated the springs in these guys. Whoo, that one flew right back. Uh oh, I got my darts crossed. I got my darts crossed. Last set, dual wielding. Wow. <laughs> and a little, you can just tell as it's leaving the barrel, there's a little bit more punch here than meets the eye. Seriously, this might be my first modding project. If you want to see a more random one-off stuff like this that isn't too crazy in the price range, Please let me know. I hear you guys about doing non-nerf blasters, and I'll get there. I hear you. There's an and more in this channel description for a reason. But that's for another time. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tiger Thor. As always, be sure to like, share, subscribe if you enjoy this type of content. Be sure to blast that notification bell, and I will see you all next one.